the Mi-28N export variant is a high-tech fighting machine that meets most international requirements of the class of helicopters. The helicopter was developed taking into account the design and operation experience of the Mi-35 and similar types of choppers. The Mi-28N export variant features high dependability, alertness and performance. It is designed to knock out armored vehicles, air mobile troops, enemy personnel, pillboxes and log and earth dugouts, artillery, army, air defense installations, slow airborne targets, enemy helicopters and to provide cover for land troops in a battlefield and escort of landing troops. The aircraft has a single main rotor and tail rotor. In terms of its technical data and performance, the helicopter is on par with similar class rotorcraft. The hover ceiling of the helicopter enables it to operate from airfields located up to 4,000 meters above sea level, including unprepared sites. And the service ceiling makes it capable of negotiating summits rising to 5,700 meters without a route change, which is very important in accomplishing missions. The helicopter is very agile and can fly advanced maneuvers such as looping, rolls, etc., thus eluding enemy missiles. The aircraft avionics makes hedge hopping flying possible. A successful mission accomplishment is achieved by built-in and external guns and external missiles and rockets. Guided missile weaponry consists of Ataka class or Sturm class supersonic anti-tank guided missiles and Igla air-to-air -air missiles. The Ataka M and Sturm V are intended for destruction of armor and protected targets, as well as slow flying targets at a range of six kilometers. According to the target type, missiles with various warheads are used including hollow charge, high explosive and rod type. Sturm and Ataka have a longer effective range and higher armor piecing capability compared to a similar class. Up to 16 missiles can be carried at a time. The Igla air-to-air -air missiles are intended for use against any tactical airplane, helicopters, cruise missiles and drones in an environment with background and man-made interference. The Igla missile is of the so-called fire-and-forget type and operates at altitudes of up to 3,500 meters above the launch level. Unguided rocket weaponry consists of S-8 supersonic 80mm rockets loaded into B-8V-20 rocket packs and S-13 122mm rockets in B-13L-1 rocket packs. The S-8 and S-13 rockets are designed to be effective at a range of 4 kilometers against heavily armored and lightly armored targets, enemy personnel and shelters, and multiple targets. One helicopter can carry up to four B-8V-20A packs of 20 rockets each and up to four B-13L-1 packs of five rockets each. According to mission, S-8 rockets can be used having tandem, hollow charge, high explosive, hollow charge, volume detonation, concrete piercing volume detonation, star and chaff warhead, and S-13 rockets with volume detonation, high explosive, and high explosive concrete piercing warhead. The S-8 COM rockets have the capacity to destroy armored targets 400 millimeters thick, and S-13 rockets concrete shelters covered with a 2 meter earth layer. External gun weaponry consists of UPK-23 250 pods, each housing a 23 millimeter gun. Gun pods are used against ground and air targets. The helicopter has a NPPU-28 turret with a 30 millimeter 2A-42 gun. The slewing range of the 2A-42 is plus minus 110 degrees in azimuth and plus 13 degrees to minus 40 degrees in elevation. 
The gun turret drive is electrical and gun feed is of two-sided belt type from two ammunition boxes mounted on the turret. The turreted gun is intended to knock out lightly armored ground and surface targets, personnel and airborne targets ranging up to four kilometers. <laughs> 